Well, Jake, he appeared to be asleep, and, you know, repeatedly his, his head would, would fall down, and he didn't pay attention to a note that his lawyer, Todd Blanche, passed him. His jaw kept falling on his chest, and his mouth kept going slack. Former President Donald Trump is getting mocked for falling asleep at trial. As jury selection got underway on Monday in the first ever criminal trial of a sitting or former president, it's kind of a big deal, uh, who was facing 34 felony counts of falsifying business records in an attempt to cover up hush money payments to an adult film actress, Stormy Daniels. Uh, Trump decided, yeah, yeah, you know what? I'm not really interested. I'm just going to catnap. Call me when, it, you know, when it's time for me to wake up. Oh, fun. Now, the internet, of course, did what it does best, uh, made fun of Trump. <laughs> <laughs> Even going to get a nickname for the 77-year-old president, Sleepy Don. Sleepy Don. Um, some responses here. We're going to start with Mother Jones DC Bureau Chief David Korn, writing, My theory, Trump's legal team sedated him. Well, I mean, honestly, that, that's what I would do. <laughs> Trump is known for doing uh, outlandish uh, outbursts and getting himself into trouble. So yeah, any smart legal team would be like, yeah, let's uh, let's just knock this guy out. <laughs> Let us do our own job, all right? So it may, it may be better off uh, for the defense if he is uh, just out for the count, all right? Uh, now, Ron Filipowski posted this. Look, he's old. The judge is keeping Sleepy Don from his nap time. Yes. Is that... Is that part of executive time or or not? Uh, if you remember when he was president, he had this big old block of time where he would sit there and he'd go on you know social media and you know, watch TV, and maybe even he would, would catch a nap. I don't know. <laughs> um, the Lincoln Project posts: Sleepy Don was up late, rage posting on Truth Social. Ah, yes, it, it, of course. Truth, Truth Central. I actually. There might be some truth to that. Either he was up late or, you know, he was up early, <laughs> depending on how you look at it. He started the day posting this at 5.39 a.m. This is morning. As virtually every legal scholar has powerfully stated, the Biden Manhattan witch hunt cases, among other things, barred by the statute of limitations. This trial should be ended by the highly conflicted presiding judge. He then waited until 5.51 to say this, the radical left Democrats are already cheating on their 2024 presidential election by bringing or helping to bring all of these bogus lawsuits against me, thereby forcing me to sit in courthouses and spend money that could be used for campaigning instead of being out in the field, knocking crooked Joe Biden, the worst president in the history of the United States, election interference. Yes, uh, he could be out doing things instead of Napping in a courtroom. Uh, that's what he's saying. <laughs> uh, other social media users uh, got into it saying, I prefer presidents who don't fall asleep before the lunch break and their hush money paid to a porn star election interference trial. Good one. Uh, another wrote, if Sleepy Don is too low energy to stay awake during the first trial or first day of his criminal trial, does he even have the stamina to be president? Hey, we're just asking questions. Just asking questions, everybody. Now, Republican voters against Trump posted this. Sleepy Joe is a projection, like everything else. So, look, that's a reference to something that Trump had used to call President Joe Biden. It's Sleepy, it's Sleepy Joe. Oh, low energy. Sleepy Joe. He's asleep at the wheel. Uh, he doesn't have the stamina required to be the president. Funny enough, that went away especially since the State of the Union speech, um, where, you know, apparently Biden, according to Trump, had shouted too much, too, too, too hateful, right? Too full of energy. Look, you had Sean Hannity out there calling him jacked up Joe. <laughs> Ridiculous. Uh, first it's Sleepy Joe, and now it's jacked up Joe. Make up your minds. Make up your minds, everybody. Uh, so, look, I guess there goes the sleepy label, uh, especially now Trump had al allegedly fallen asleep in court. <laughs> uh, now, one person did notice one thing that happened to be missing from this, um, and that would be the absence of a pillow. 
prompting him to ask, where's the MyPillow guy when you need him? Yes. Where, where is he? Where is he indeed? Just forget about the evidence. <laughs> you, had, you had one job, Mike. One job. One job. But look, seriously, I, I don't blame Donald Trump for falling asleep. I mean, he's bored. How do you expect him to sit there and listen to all these people with their legal stuff? It's kind of boring. And not even mention how great he is or pepper his name through it. I mean, how do you expect anybody to sit through that? Of course he's going to get bored and grab a little nap time. You know, until things that come up that actually might interest him. After all, we know Trump is uh, nothing but a big man-child who just can't help himself.